أعوذ بالله من الشيطان الرجيم بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم In November of 1917, the British government did something which was incredibly strange and mysterious. A Britain, which is now the prince of the secular world, The secular world takes religion out of politics. And Britain is the prince of the secular world. Britain issues a declaration known as the Balfour Declaration. In November 1917, that it is the intention of His Majesty's government to work for the establishment of a Jewish national home in the Holy Land. Did you hear that? The only thing stranger than that that ever occurred in history was the day that the cow jumped over the moon. Why would a secular state which leads the world of secular states declare its intention to work for the establishment of a Jewish national home meaning a Jewish state in the Holy Land two months later this was October 1917 In December 1917 it is a British army led by General Allenby which defeats the Ottoman Islamic army and liberates the Holy Land and when Allenby entered into Jerusalem the British general declared Today the crusades are over. Oh? Oh, but the crusades were supposed to have been Christian wars. And you are now a secular state. You're not a Christian state, you're a secular state. How come a secular Britain is continuing a crusade started by the pope a thousand years before that's strange that is incredibly strange between 1918 and 1948 it is the island of britain which ruled over the holy land on a mandate conferred by the League of Nations and during that period of time with tremendous deception while pretending to keep the Jews out Britain opened the doors for the Jews of Europe to enter into the Holy Land and to reclaim it as their own in between came the interlude of adolf hitler <coughs> which speeded up the movement of the jews from europe to the holy land in 1948 britain did something strangest of all Britain is a state with a tremendous commitment to the rule of law. In 
And so every time Britain decolonized, there was always an insistence of illegal transfer of power. And then you had the flags going up at midnight. Huh? And the national anthem and the constitution and so on. A legal transfer of power. It happened in Trinidad as well. But in 1948, when Britain left the Holy Land, she left like a thief in the dark. For the first time, for the only time in British history, there was no legal transfer of power from Britain to the successor state. In 1948, Britain acted as a midwife for the baby to be born. The European Jewish state of Israel. And so my answer is that that island of Tamimudari is Britain.